Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop CC 2021 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to create a synthetic uh, lens flare like this one. I'm going to show you how to select a bunch of different styles of lens flares. I'm going to show you how to move them and adjust them and rotate them and do all that cool stuff and all do that in Photoshop. All right, let's turn this layer off. This is the original and this is the adjusted with lens flare. Okay. I'm going to delete that layer and we're going to start from scratch if you want to follow along. Okay, the first step, as you can see here, I've loaded in an image. Yep, the next step, if you're following along, is you want to drag and drop this image on the plus sign in the bottom right here. This is going to create a duplicate layer. So this way we're working non-destructively and we can go ahead and make some adjustments. I'm just going to turn the bottom layer off and make sure that I'm clicked on the top layer. The next step is you want to go to your properties panel. If you don't see it, for me, it's right here. But if you don't see it, go to window and then just click on properties and it will pop out. There is a chance that when you first load this, you will not see the bottom here. So you want to go ahead and extend this down so that you can see the quick actions. From here, click on view more and you're going to get a few options. The one we're looking for is Add Lens Flare. Left click on this and then it's going to say, do you want to do this? And yes, we do. So left click on Apply. So we're applying the Lens Flare now. Okay, this is the default location and the default style of Lens Flare. This might be all you need to do and that's what you're looking for. And if that's the case, power to you. We can make a few adjustments. I'm going to double click on lens flare right here just on the word and you're going to see here that we can adjust a few things. We're going to adjust the brightness of the lens flare so if you want it a little brighter like holy smokes or if you want it to be a little subtler which well, might make sense but let's go with a brighter for now. You'll also notice there are four styles of lens flares. There's the 50 to 300 millimeter zoom, a 35 millimeter prime which is the standard movie type uh, shooter. We got 105 millimeter prime and we've also got the movie prime. Well, let's go. Whoa, that looks pretty cool. But anyways, guys, we're going to go with the default one, but again, you can go ahead and make adjustments. Also notice that it only shows up here in this uh, little box here. So when we're making changes, you're not seeing it in the full image. You're just seeing it in this little reduced size uh, thumbnail. So back to the first one. Also, I'm going to show you one other thing you're going to see here plus inside of the inside of the lens flare. This is important because we can adjust where the lens flare appears. So if we want the lens flare to be at the top right, let's say, we can just do that just like that. So we've adjusted the position. When we hit OK, OK, pardon me, you're going to see that the lens flare is now at the top right. This is how you make a lens flare inside Photoshop. It takes two minutes at most. Make the adjustments. That's all I got for you guys on this one. I've got a ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned. Be back soon.